Hey guys, what's up? Stephen here, and we're back to another Roblox tutorial. And it, this is part of the UI creation tutorial that we're making. I hope you're following it. I hope you're subscribed so you can get all the videos. And also, on this video, I'm gonna teach you a UI gradient. Let's say you don't want to use an image button or an image label to kind of design uh, your game. Uh, you want just the simple color shading, but you can't do that on a text label. Like it's just one color and you can't really adjust it. And you can just add custom colors to it. Now, this is where UI gradient comes fr from. So if I use UI gradient, notice that I just have this plain yellow and black on the preliminary games but if I add but it and I can only change one color but if I add UI gradient I can change its color to basically another color but the catch is let's choose a bit of a yellowish but the catch on this one is you can add a certain rainbow uh, if you know what trails is uh, you'd be familiar with this but basic what this do is it adds another function on your label or on your image that goes something like around here so I have this you see that there's a shade of orange and I'm controlling where that shade of orange will go so I want it to be around the middle and let's make this one much yellowish or yeah let's make it a bit uh, green and I, w I want to copy this to oops sorry uh, I want to move this around here then I want to add another green color and I'll have this kind of color and notice that the text isn't changing it's just the background but if you want the color to change you you can set it to white this is going to change its color to actually match the gradient so if you want it to be seen let's make that Let's make that first let's just make it first appear and we can change it from here add that little twist right there like a darkening stuff Yeah, so that's how you match the color uh, on on the screen to your gradient. But if you don't like that, you can always like choose the color that you prefer to. Like if you want orange on the font, it's not gonna affect it. But if you want the text to be affected, you just need to put it on white. So you'll have that similar to like fading screen and course you can always like remove the text strokes transparency and just have that the dark stuff or maybe add a little twist of orange on that something ar along those lines so this how you like edit the color on on a text it can be used on text button it can be used on text label and it what we use is text label so any text box you can use this stuff gradient you can even use it on s some frames to some extent but of course if you're just gonna use image label or image button that's a separate matter and I hope you found value on this video and you learned something about UI gradient 
and if you ever have any questions about it comment down below and if you like the video please press that like button and subscribe to our channel we do upload daily and catch you on another video bye bye